Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to share with you the Peter Parker from the Retrowave Spidey that I got from AliExpress. This is the authentic one that I got it myself from a pre-order. And this one over here is the one that I got from the bunch of KO Spideys that I got recently and did comparisons on. You can check out their comparisons in the link in the description below. The thing is, for this Peter Parker figure, I bought it off with a bunch of KOs but I really can't find much differences between these two. The one that I got from AliExpress is really the same as the authentic. The eyes are painted recently for both. Same goes for the spectacles. The head scalp is about the same quality. And there's no gaps for the one that I got from AliExpress. The pegs of the hands are also the same. Same paintwork on the belt. No gaps at the knee joint. Some of the KOs that I got, there's a gap at the knee joint. Same thing printed at the bottom. The only difference between the authentic and the one that I got from AliExpress is the number at the back of the thigh. The authentic that I got has this serial number at the back. The one that I got from AliExpress does not have that number. But besides that, the whole figure itself is really the same. Even the letter R at the ankle is present for both and also our L or for left. Same thing for the camera, they really look the same. I really can't find any differences between them. At the bottom, there's also the number 2 for both of them. And again, not much difference between the head. The paintwork of the figure from AliExpress is just about as decent as the authentic that I got. The only thing is that for the one that I got from AliExpress, there is a slight gap between the hair and the mask half. Very slight gap over here. There's no gap for the authentic one. And on the inside, for the authentic, there is a B2 sculpted on it. But for the one that I got from AliExpress, is B1. So maybe some of you guys who have this figure can help me see if inside of the head of your authentic has the B2 on it. So yeah, for this one, I got it from AliExpress with the other bunch of KOs from the same seller but this really doesn't feel like a KO to me. It really feels authentic. There is no difference between this one and the authentic one that I pre-ordered. The only difference like I mentioned earlier is only the numbers. The rest of the figure is really the same. I scrutinized and I cannot find any difference on this one that I got from AliExpress. So if you really have a hard time trying to find, I guess you can check out this figure because yeah, it really does look authentic and feels authentic too. This figure is definitely good for custom if you can't find the original one. Thanks for watching. Do share in the comments below what you think about this Peter Parker figure that I got from AliExpress, whether it's authentic or whether it's a factory overrun or reject or something because this one definitely doesn't feel KO at all to me. And stay tuned for more comparison videos.